Good morning, everybody. My name is Mrs. Eve, and today I would like to share with you all one of my favorite stories in the fall. It's called What's the Time, Grandma Wolf, and it was written by Ken Brown. It's a little bit suspenseful because, as we know, wolves in stories are usually not very good characters, are they? Think about the three little pigs, the little red riding hood. But should we judge a wolf in all stories by the wolves in some stories? Let's find out. You see, in the woods there lived a wolf, and everybody said, She's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Let's leave her alone. Don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But these friends wanted to know, and so they crept closer. And Beaver, who is very bold, barked. Hey, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? <laughs> Grandma Wolf sat up in bed. She opened her eyes. They were very, very large. And then she blinked. Oh, my goodness. I can't see a thing without my glasses. Where are my glasses? Oh, here they are. Oh, much better. In the woods there lived a wolf. And everybody said, She's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone, don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But these friends wanted to know and so they crept closer. And Rabbit, who is very reckless, repeated, ah! <laughs> What's the time, Grandma Wolf? Grandma Wolf yawned a big yawn. were sharp and shiny. <gasps> oh my goodness, I've got morning breath. It's time I brush my teeth. And she picked up a toothbrush. It was very pink and very big. <laughs> ah, minty fresh. In the woods there lived a wolf. And everybody said, she's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone, don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But these friends wanted to know and so they crept closer still. And Possum, who is very playful, piped up. Um, hi, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? <laughs> to the kitchen and picked up her kettle. It was very large and very black. It's time I scrubbed the stew pot. Much better. She placed it on the fire. In the woods there lived a wolf and everybody said, She's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone, don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But these friends wanted to know and so they crept closer. And Chipmunk, who is very cheerful, chattered. <laughs> hey, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? And Grandma Wolf picked up. An axe. It was very sharp and very shiny. Oh, it's time I chopped the wood. Chop, 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 chop. In the woods there lived a wolf and everybody said, she's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone, don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But these friends wanted to know. And Mouse, who is very modest, murmured, Um, what was the time, Grandma Wolf? Grandma Wolf picked up her water bucket. It's time.
time I fetched the water. <laughs> she filled the stew pot. In the woods there lived a wolf, and everybody said, She's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone, don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But these friends wanted to know, and so they crept closer still. And Fawn, who is very faithful, fretted. Ah, uh, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? Grandma Wolf took out her knife. It was very sharp. It's time I chopped the vegetables. Chop, 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 chop. She added them to the stew pot. In the woods there lived a wolf, and everybody said, She's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone, don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But we friends wanted to know, and so we crept closer still. And Raccoon, who is very rambunctious, regaled. Hey, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? And Grandma Wolf fetched her matches and lit the fire. bubbling and the soup was simmering. In the woods there lived a wolf and everybody said, she's big and she's bad. She's old and she's hairy. Best leave her alone. Don't go near her home. She's mean and she's scary. But these friends wanted to know and so they crept closer still. And squirrel who is very sassy, scolded. Hey, what's the time, Grandma Wolf? Grandma Wolf took a step towards the friends and said, it's dinner time! Come on, all my little friends, come and join me for some vegetable stew. And while you eat, I will share with you one of my favorite stories called What's the Time, Grandma Wolf? And that is the story of What's the Time, Grandma Wolf by Ken Brown. Were you scared? Was it a little suspenseful? I hope you'll check out the book. And when you do, you'll see on the back, there's a instructions on how to play a game called What's the Time, Grandma Wolf, which is a really fun game to play, especially with your family. So anyway, have a wonderful, wonderful week. Stay safe and well out there. Love to all of you. Mwah. Goodbye.